In this video, I release, review, and show you how to download my brand new Doge client, which features an insane FPS boost. And I'm gonna make a deal with you. As soon as this video reaches 3,000 likes, I'll upload my next Fiverr video. Oh, but before you get into this video, I wanna let you know, I'm giving away one such speed Luna client cape, and all you guys have to do to enter is like this video, comment your IGN down below, and you must be subscribed. And if you haven't already, go ahead, join my Discord server, because I'm gonna be releasing exclusive packs and content on my server. So make sure to join, the link is on the screen right now. And without further ado, happy new years and let's get into the video. Okay, so first things first, happy new years to all of you. I'm sure you're all just happy to put this year behind us and look towards a better year for everyone. Although this year sucked, I wanna say a huge thank you to each and every one of you for making this a memorable year on YouTube for me. I really feel like this year has been a huge development for my channel and I just can't thank you all enough for the continuous support. So around a week ago, I hired a developer on Fiverr to create a custom Minecraft client for me. Little did I know this client would include an insane FPS boost. As you can see, I have the client loaded up right now. Now, a couple of days ago, I uploaded the video pretty much showing the whole process of me buying the client and then trying it out on Hypixel. Now, I said in that video, if we break 3,000 likes, then I would release the client. Little did I know, we would smash 5,000 likes. I think we gained around 2,000 new members in my Discord server too. I would not have expected the amount of hype and support for this client. But here we are, this is the Doge client. Now, I'm about to take this client onto Hypixel and show you just how overpowered this client is on like Sky Wars, Bed Wars, and even UHC duels. And towards the end of the video, I'm going to be showing you how to download and install this client. But anyway, let's get into it. Oh, and as I mentioned, when this video reaches 3,000 likes, I'm going to upload my next Fiverr video, which to be honest, I think is better than my last one. But anyway, let's get into it. Well, guys, I did not expect to be making this video so fast, but you guys went crazy for the Doge client. I had no idea that you guys would want this client so badly, but here I am. Today, we are releasing the Doge client, and I'm going to be showing you and telling you how overpowered this client is on Hypixel and how to install it and how to access all of the mods in the client. I wanted to start 2021 by giving something back to you guys, which is why this is my first video of 2021. And I hope you all had a very happy new years. Now, having said that, I know 2020 was very difficult for some of you, and I really hope we all have a better year this year. So about a week ago, I paid a developer from Fiverr to create a custom Minecraft client for me, which is this client, the Doge client. Now, little did I know how overpowered this client would be on Hypixel. My hit registration for some reason feels super smooth using this thing and I had no idea that you guys would go so crazy for this client and it, the name of the client is actually really fitting around my channel name. If many of you didn't know, I created my name Such Speed based off of the Doge meme, which is like the Shibu meme. I'm sure many of you remember it. It was like the Such Wow, Much Wow, the dog. You guys remember the dog meme and that's also the origins of this client's name. I just wanted to create a great meme. Now, as you can see when I go in F5, when you download this client, don't be alarmed, but you have this little doge right behind you who's going to just be there accompanying you. You get a free cape when you download this client. And as you can see, I haven't PVP'd at all over the last like day or two. I've been recovering from, oh my, I'm am, I am insane. This client is insane. I've just been tearing through the competition in this game. You guys have just witnessed how overpowered this thing is. I have 22 and 2. Now, several notable features about this client. If you look in the bottom left, you have the armor status. It doesn't display anything other than just your items that you're wearing. I don't know why it doesn't have like a percentage indicator or anything like that. If you take a look towards the top left, you can see this Doge client has its own name at the top, as well as the X, Y, and Z chords. The FPS, which is insane on this client, I don't even know why. This client doesn't even feature Optifine, yet it still gets some crazy FPS. And it also has CPS, as well as Sprinting Toggled. Now, if you look on the top right, it also has Keystrokes, WASD, and left, left and right mouse button, which is a very important PvP mod. And I would say most of these mods are just mainly used for PvP. So if you're thinking of playing Hypixel or any 1.8 PVP server, then this is the client for you. I just think it's crazy that this client doesn't have any built-in like performance optifine or anything. Yeah, I still get some insane FPS boost when I'm using this thing. And to think, I found this client on Fiverr. I get better performance on this client than I do on most big company Minecraft clients that have been created. And I'm getting destroyed by uh, the dragon sword right now. This guy's named after a high pixel item, really. Now, I hope you guys all had a really good New Year's Eve. Personally, I was spending time with my family and just kind of reminiscing over the year. You know, just kind of enjoying my 
myself and I was originally gonna upload this video yesterday I was just so tired yesterday like that I didn't want I didn't want to rush it either I really want to take my content seriously moving into 2021 and I'm sure some of you have maybe noticed that I've been increasing my editing quality as well as just my general video ideas I don't just want to upload for the heck of it I want to upload content that you guys are gonna love and enjoy I was also planning to do face cam today and that's something I want to talk about moving into 2021 I want to start featuring face cam a lot more in my videos in fact I'm planning on buying a brand new camera and I'm also upgrading my equipment quite a lot I plan on getting a new microphone because I've been using the same microphone for like four years now and I think it's definitely time for a change I'm also excited because I ordered a glorious model o mouse and I was originally gonna hide it to you guys but I got the wireless one and when it comes I'm gonna make a full unboxing video and kind of like compare that mouse to my razor that I've been using for years which is also pretty much broken at this point but as you guys can see the doge client just shreds through players I can't believe this meme of a client is actually so overpowered and as you can see the doge client has made this guy go into hiding underground that's just how overpowered this client is I, I don't really know why this guy's gone underground but he, he might be like making his armor better or something probably something we should be doing although actually we can do that okay let's go ahead and make our armor better I think we can kill this guy now we were kind of trolling before you know I was I was doing pretty bad but now I think we can actually get this guy all right oh my god we're destroying this guy and he's just chugging heads we're still destroying him all right, he still has heads, dude. How many heads does this guy have? My lord. Hopefully, he doesn't have much more healing. I think he's just mainly used all his gapples first. He probably has another head still, though. How many heads do you have left, bud? Yep, he has another one. Oh, my god. We might actually lose this fight based on this guy's healing. I only have one gapple remaining. Damn. This is it. We are out of healing after this. He gave me healing. Wait, he knows my healing. All right, cool. Oh, thank you. All right, he gave me more healing. I got... Oh, he gave me more healing. What the hell? Okay, let's go, Dragon Sword. I'm gonna put a love heart in chat. Thank you. I don't I don't know why he gave me healing, to be honest. I thought this guy was playing like a complete and utter like hooligan, but somehow he's just giving me more healing. I guess he just wants a good final fight. Oh my god, run half a heart. He's gonna bow me. I'm sure of it. Oh my god. Either way, I'm uploading this because this was an insane fight. How have we not killed this guy though? We might even just lose on the Doge client. I don't think I've ever lost on the Doge client, which is interesting, but no. No, we- Oh, we messed up there. We messed up our parkour. Damn, that is a good fight. But we had like 70% melee accuracy, which is just insane for this client. I have no idea how that is so high. But I feel like I just aim so much better with this thing. Welcome to Ranked Sky Wars Doge Client Edition. Now, I personally love this game mode with this client. I think this client helps so much playing Sky Wars. I don't know why. I think it's just to do with the fact my hits just feel insane on this thing. Now, if you guys are wondering about the texture pack I'm using in today's video, I'm using Gamble 16X, and I'll leave a link down below. Below. I really like this pack actually. It's one of the packs I featured in my recent trying your packs video So a huge shout out to you guys and if you want to take part in my future videos I had I saw a lot of your guys comments and yes I do read your comments believe it or not I was seeing a lot of people saying that they want to enter their own texture packs and to do that All you have to do is join my discord server The link is on the screen like usual and for some reason hypixel still seems like a bit of a lag pixel I didn't I didn't know I didn't realize that hypixel was still so laggy But I guess we're just gonna have to deal with it and this guy is called pepe the frog. Yo, what's up, man? How you doing? Pepe's chilling down there. I wasted my speed there, which kind of sucks. Actually, just me versus him. I didn't even realize. All right, you know what? Yo, what's up, Pepe? How you doing? All right, we're gonna kill Pepe. Pepe's down. Pepe down. Oh my god. Pepe. All right. We just did a lot of damage to Pepe. Oh, he's gone all the way back to his island. Really? Okay. Well, this is some high octane PvP versus Pepe the Frog. Oh, I don't want to wait a minute to refill, but I feel like I might have to because this guy seems like he'd be a bit of a stubborn player that doesn't want to come over to me. But we'll go ahead and loot all the rest of these chests, I suppose. You know, maybe we'll get lucky. Oh, we got very lucky. Damn. Oh my god, when you have Fire Aspect and the Doge Client together, it is stupidly overpowered. That guy is off the edge of the world. There we go. We just won that very easily. Okay, so as promised, I'm now going to show you how to download and get the Doge Client working on your Minecraft. So once you've clicked the link in the description and downloaded the client, you will be presented with this file here. Now this is the client zipped up. Now what you're going to want to do is either put this on your desktop or keep it in your downloads, but ultimately you're going to want to open this. Now once you've opened this little file here, you see this is the Doge Client. Now this is important. You keep this open regardless if you have WinRAR or you don't. I believe Windows even have their own version of this. So once you've unlocked it, now what you're going to want to do is actually go to your percent app data percent like I have done and then go into dot Minecraft. Now once you're in dot Minecraft, I'm sure many of you know there is a section called versions. Now what you're going to want to do in here is open versions up and you're going to want to go ahead and drag this file Doge client over to versions. And as you can see, I've already done so. And this is what it creates. It creates two files, essentially your own profile to launch the client through Minecraft. 
Minecraft. Now, once you've done this, you're going to then want to load up Minecraft and obviously create your own profile on the client. As you can see, I have already done so. And if you don't know how to create your own profile, you go into installations. And as you can see here, you create a new one and then you link it to Doge client. You just need to search through your versions and you can name it whatever. As you can see, I've already named mine Doge client and it's a pretty straightforward process. Once you've done that, just make sure you've got the Doge client selected. Go over to Minecraft Java Edition and simply play. It's a very straightforward process. And if you did decide to download the client, please leave a like on the video. Greatly appreciated. And I hope you guys all enjoyed today's video. If you did, please be sure to let me know in the comments. And I hope you guys all have a very good year. I will be back with another video very soon. As soon as we get 3000 likes on this video, I'll be uploading my next Fiverr video. So I hope you all enjoyed and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Yeah.